एवरी वन माई सेल्फ डॉक्टर एम मोनिका असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ बिजनेस अडमिनिस्ट्रेशन सी ए एंड सेंट जोसफ कॉलेज ऑफ आर्ट्स एंड सैंस अटारामास कडलोर टूडे वी आर गोयिंग टू सी अबाउट कॉस्ट ऑफ कैपिटल कॉस्ट ऑफ कैपिटल इट रेफर्स टू द रिटर्न ए कंपनी एक्सपेक्टेड ऑन द स्पेसिफिक इन्वेस्टमेंट टू मेक इट्स वर्थ द expenditure of resources in other word the cost of capital determines the rate of return required to persuade investors to finance a capital budgeting project the definitions of cost of capital the first milton h spencer says cost of capital is the minimum required rate of returns which a firm required as a condition for undertaking an investment according to Esther Solomon the cost of capital is the minimum required rate of earnings or the cut off rate of expenditure capital expenditures is the components of cost of capital there are three fact factors to the cost of capital the first return at zero risk level it related to the expected rate of return when a project involves no financial or business risk premium is again premium for the business risk it's generally business risk premium is determined by the capital budgeting decision for investment proposals if the firm selected a project which it has more than the normal risk the suppliers of funds for the project will naturally expect a higher rate of return than the normal rate thus the cost of capital increases the premium for the financial risk it related to the patterns of capital structures of the firm a firm which has higher debt content in its capital structure should have more risk then the firm which has comparatively low debt content next classifications of cost of capital the cost of capital defined as the minimum rate of return a firm must earn on its investment in order to satisfy the investors and to maintain its market values it is the investors required rate of returns it's also refers to the discount rate which is used while determining the present value of estimated future cash flows the major classifications of cost of capital are historical cost and future cost specific cost and composite cost average cost and marginal cost explicit cost and implicit cost the competitions of cost of capital the cost of capital involves there are two categories first competitions of specific cost second one competitions of composite cost the cost of specific cost includes cost of debt cost of preference shares cost of equity shares cost of retained the earning it's a cost of debt it is the rate of return which is expected by the lenders and cost of preference shares capital normally a fixed rate of dividend in payable on preference shares but in the practical sense preference dividend is regularly paid by the companies when they earn sufficient amount of profit next cost of cap equity capital cost of equity capital it may be defined as the minimum rate of return that the firm must earn on its investment and also the market price of the equity shares on unchanged the cost of retained earning it refers to the portion of the profit retaining by the company for future development business use and expansion is known as retained earning 
So next computations of composite cost weighted average cost of capital it refers to the weighted average cost of different sources of finance. It is very important in financial decision making. The steps involved in computations of weighted average cost of capital must the calculate the cost of each of the sources of finance in ascertain next assigning weights to specific cost next one multiplying the cost of each sources by the appropriate weight and divide out the total weighted cost by the total weight so ko is the overall cost of capital wd is the weighted of debt wp is the weighted of preference shares of capital wr is the rate of the earning w is the equity share capitals kd is the specific cost of debt kb equal to specific cost of preference share capital and kr equal to so specific cost of rate of the earning ke is the specific cost of equity share capital its weighted average cost of capital can computed the so the following formulas kw equal to examination of xw divided by 7w so thank you everyone